<laughs> Welcome back to WBTV News 3 at Nan. I'm here live in the studio with Arden McLaughlin with the Charlotte Mecklenburg Library. She's got some great like, reads for us. It said live, and I thought, I know. are we going where are live, we? live somewhere? All we right. are. We're on a trip. <laughs> we ventured out. Y'all don't know where we are. Yeah, we, don't right? like, we don't like to tell you. We don't four square or we're whatever those things are. We're live in the studio. We are live in the studio. With some three great picks that you and have chosen for us And you saw my prop as well. You, so I have got... I love lipstick. Uh -huh. Everyone who knows me knows I love lipstick. And there's something about we as women and the way we bond over the weirdest things. Yeah. And I bond with so many women over lipstick. <laughs> so that leads me into my first book, which is hilariously funny, but also just be prepared. There's some, you only talk about it with your chicks. I so, love the title of it, first of all. You have lipstick on your teeth. I almost, I told y'all, I always put lipstick on my teeth, and I'm like, I just cannot, I don't like that. That drives me nuts. But these are all stories that you'd only tell in the powder room. Okay. So, you know, you go with your girl, and you're like sitting in there, and you're just like, sweetie, check that out. You got lipstick on your teeth. Or, you know, we were just talking earlier, you're like, you're like your shirt. I was like, cool. Yeah, and I'm like telling you all about my sales. Yes. That's what this book is about in the weird way we bond. Yeah. But it's so funny. And these stories are really funny. My friend Lori wrote one of them. Whew, that girl's crazy. And <laughs> she tells it full <laughs> that fledged in like there. a good one. Okay. Okay. Another way women bond is over food uh -huh, and this. supper clubs. Now, this character is very fun. She actually is trying to start a new life for herself. Mm -hmm. And so she starts an underground supper club in her landlord's apartment while he's out of town. Oh. So there's a little mystery and intrigue and some delicious recipes in here too. And I just think it's funny how we get around a table and start eating and suddenly our life story pours out. Oh like, yeah, absolutely. What is that about us? Yeah. And the last one is <laughs> the, uh, coffee. Now, if you really want to get me talking, Give me a few expresses. So Vanity Fair by Megan Caldwell. I also love this one because it's book themed as well. So it's a little bakery. The woman goes in as a copywriter and she, all the little recipes in here and things are all have a book twist because they open up right across from the New York Public Library, a bakery. Ah. So a little special place in my heart. And this yes. woman actually is again starting all over her husband has left her bankrupt and blah 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 uh -huh. but she comes in her own with lattes and literature love that so i love these i just <laughs> love women are we are the weirdest creatures but we're funny and we love to write about it so check these out and make sure you tell your girlfriend if she has lipstick yes, on her teeth yes please do that that is the moral of the story God, <laughs> just be fair kelly give us a final look at your forecast